reputation. Yeah, just a little bit. Okay, going into game one. We got, once again, look at this. Oh, this winner's finals is beautiful. We got Connor and Bimo, the Stevens crew of Bayo and Ness I'm versus surprised. the NST crew of the last second thrown together team of Lucario, Ike, Bombimbi, and Trolldog. Eh. I'm surprised that uh, Trolldog's not doing a uh, Nubis strat. No, 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 he doesn't need it. He's been doing very well with Lucario and Doubles today without taking that first off. And this is... Winner's uh, finals. Winner's finals, nice. So right now though, uh, here's the disagree. Here's the problem right now for Trollog and Bombimbi. Bayonetta is on the screen right now, and this is not me saying anything bad about Bayonetta. Bayonetta is just the best character in the game, and lava combos like that, which did not actually kill Ike even at 94%, is still the most dangerous thing for them right now. And the spacing options of Ness come out can make this really daunting because it makes it so that Trollog and Bombimbi actually have to play super aggressive and have to constantly go in. But it's sometimes hard to get on, in on these characters, and even if you can get in on Ness, there's always going to be the lingering threat of Connor in the background with Bayonetta. Yeah. And the stuff like that, that up smash right yeah, there from Bayonetta. That was actually a really nice up air by BMO. He was, uh, Connor saved him from the lag by doing that grab and just let it cancel. But uh, he was able to like, get, get in there. Ooh, this is a pretty good... Uh, they, they had some good uh, edge control there, but they weren't able to keep it up. So right now, because of Bayonetta's uh, stocks, stock lead, Lucario does have the uh, yeah the aura aura. advantage. He so does he, have the aura advantage. He's hitting a little bit harder now. The uh, second that uh, Bayonetta goes down to two stocks, that aura will go away, I believe. I believe it goes yeah. away because it's a stock advantage kind of thing. I see. I think there's even times where like it gets a little bit weaker. Like I know if he's up a stock, the aura is not as prevalent, but. Uh, Oh, let, let's, let's see how Trolldog can abuse this uh, boost in Oh, nice Ooh. up air coming out. But, uh, Ike threw out the up air while Bayonetta threw out the neutral air. And luckily for Bombimbi and Trolldog, they were actually oh, able to keep it. Nice, nice pivot grab from the witch time. All right, for a second, I thought uh, Connor was at high percent, but he's only at 29. So I, I saw... Uh, oh, Bambi my the gosh. The side oh, beat Ike dead. actually did end up killing Bimo up top. Bimo is down to one stock, the first one stock of the tournament. Of the tournament match. Ooh, oh, the witch time. his own uh, teammate. Not able to capitalize on it, though. Oh, uh, nah, nice air dodge by Bimby. He was able to get past that up smash. He's at 132. Yeah, since they're both heavy, they're going to be living a lot longer. So that's uh, another way they're going to... Oh, never mind. They get back thrown. <laughs> that's going to kill regardless of your weight. But uh, having two heavyweights is going to let them live longer and get past the uh, thing that it comes. Ooh. Ooh. And there goes Lucario. Now, here's the situation we're in. Everyone except for Connor is down to one stock. With how these characters play, your best bet is for Trolldog to go in and get that stock off of Connor as fast as possible because things like this can happen with Bayonetta. will carry Ike over to the side. Luckily, able nice to get out of it. Nice job by Bimo breaking up the, uh, the up throw combo. That could have killed uh, Connor if, it, if, he if he's not careful out. enough, yeah. All the witch time too fast, oh, yeah. not being able to do too much. But Connor does have Troll Dog in the ladder combo. Oh, oh my god, Troll Dog. Good nice hit SDI getting Trolldog. out of that and punishing it with a double jump up air. All right, so still uh, everybody's back on their last stock. Uh, Connor at 0%. He, he's going to be, uh, he should try and like stock tank a little bit. Now, this is the problem right here where you get Troll Dog off of stage. And now we're down to just Ike. The forward are coming oh up, but the dash deck will right. kill Ness. This is now one. Ike Bayonetta. And if you remember last time, this is something that was actually the grand finals of the last NST tournament. It was Connor uh, Bombimbi, and Bombimbi actually ended up beating Connor's Bayonetta, making Connor switch to Rosa, in which he took the tournament. But now this is the thing. Bombimbi took both games one and two of those off of air dodge reads. Can, does he have the strength and willpower at 139% yeah, to actually that's... take this game back? If anybody is the one to take a stock from Connor, it's definitely Bimby. He's high, really high up on the PR. He's third? I think... Oh, see, no, he tried, for it. He tried for it again. Malarson and then Bimby, right? I, something like that. But he tried again if you didn't see that. Oh, the witch time. That No, he grabbed legend time. Okay, that could have uh, yeah, been he, bad. Gonna, uh, that stall. forward throw will not kill. Nah, Ike's too heavy. Wow, that, that was actually a nice mix-up. He, he, he was looking like he was going high for a second, but mm -hmm. he just kept charging. I got 170 percent. He has to be careful by ledge here. Normal getups are going to be Yikes, bad. Yikes! That those, back here. It's so that. good at catching roll-ups because uh, it has no lag. So he, um, even if you, you miss their neutral getup, uh, the roll-up the roll-up lag still leaves them open. See, one thing that I was noticing there is more towards the end when he was getting a high percent, Bombimbi was choosing to go for those neutral getups.
Mm-hmm. And with Bayonetta, like, she, Bayonetta's just gonna sit there, or Kana's just gonna and literally sit there and wait for a reaction. And especially at his percent, with that kind of get up, like, Kana's gonna go, okay, and I'm gonna back her, you're, and you're dead now. Or it's easy for Kana to also grab him and just do a forward throw. And even though Ike is heavy, he was at such a high percent that it could have been game with a couple yeah. pummels. But going into game two, we're going to Battlefield right now, actually. You Sticking with like- all the same characters, and I don't disagree with this at all. This last game was actually very close. Yeah, being able to live longer from uh, and not die to Bayonet combos like they were. Uh, actually, they were dodging it. Oh, well, but side combo from Bayo. Bayo kills slow early on Town City. Ooh, nice follow from Yeah, uh, and this stage, Indy. especially with these tripods for Ike, definitely benefit for Ike. So, um, I'm not sure how Lucario and Nesto on this stage. Oh, that's the thing. Um, yeah, I don't know if you know anything either. I, I, I feel like it. N- Nesta's alright. Like, back throw is still back throw. Uh, yeah. Platforms like don't really mess him up. I, I know, like, Olimar doesn't like this stage because. No. Uh, but there's no Olimar on the screen. But there's no Olimar on the screen, so. <laughs> that back throw will be enough to take the stock. Oh, wow. Oh, oh my look God. at those combos right. coming up from Yeah, he already used his double it. jump, so he couldn't really fin- uh, extend that combo. Still a uh, nice conversion by Connor. Really knowing uh, where his teammate was at and the angles of. Uh, Ness's aerials. Connor once again trying to take Trollog up top but not able to do too much. Trollog actually fell off from the platform there while trying to punish. Connor not again able to kill Ooh, up top. Hits both of them up air. All right, let's see if uh, Trolldog can get this edge guard on uh, Bimbi. I mean, yeah. on uh, Bimo. They need to watch out because stuff like this can happen. Oh, nice tech coming out from Trollog. But uh, Bimo <laughs> and Connor are both still at three stocks, and Bimo's actually at a small percentage right now. Like, a smaller than compared to most. But there goes Bayonetta. Bimo is still up to three stocks. Forward throw, not going to lead to anything. Yeah, so we got Bimbi getting count. Oh, that back right now. Yeah, it's not going to kill just yet. 104 on Battlefield. But, You'll have to watch it, though. But Jolog and Bomb Bimbi are at high percentages right now. Nice up air by Trolldog. Able to get off the ledge. All right, it looks like uh, he's starting to take stage control. Yeah, he, he was trying to get counter off of... Uh, mm-hmm. Dog, so he couldn't really edge guard Bimo there. Oh wow, the down smash actually ended up killing Troll Dog. That's something like I don't really. Uh, they're not like that will also kill. He gimped him with the PK Thunder. Oh, that was nice use of the tail. But what Bimby needs to start doing is he, he needs to get Troll Dog to split up Connor so he can just start countering those upbees from Bimo because they're not really abusing Ness's recovery because uh, every time they try and get them uh, close. Uh, Connor's just splitting them back up. Oh, right now. Oh, that could have been a bad situation for Trollog. Trollog is doing a decent job of getting out of these ladder combos from Bayonetta right now. Yeah, Con- Connor and Bimo are still up a stock. This, yeah, this, this is, is, hard this is not the best position that Bombimbi and Trollog want to be in. Oh, what's up, uh, Taco Do- uh, Dogi? And Vevo's in chat. But right now, looking at chat while you could be looking at the game, that back air from Ike coming out, killing Bayonetta, one sock. Oh, and that Ooh, back that throw! Ah, I thought it we'll that take it. Way. Ike is all alone now, while Ness still has nice the counter. extra stock. Uh, that oh, nice time. oh, that oh my be- god, he missed it! This man's luck! Cool. I'm surprised that was the punish he went for, honestly. Yeah. But, oh, oh yeah, they're trying to style. Bimo wants to style. Yikes, yeah, that's it. Oh, yeah, he gave Without up. Without your double jump, you can't, you can't make it back from there. He gave up. So, oh here, uh, let me tell Vinny something. He's, I mean, is he playing right now or not? No. Okay. So going into game three right now. Going into I'm game busy, Bebo. three right now. Bimo and Connor up to. Oh hey Screech! All right, I, I know for a second. <laughs> So, Trollog and Bombimbi taking a different approach. Bombimbi deciding to not go for his singles main, but instead going over to Donkey Kong? Ooh. Well, it looks like, which is very interesting, because this is going to make Bombimbi so much more susceptible to, to games? the... Well, no. Uh, but it's going to make um, Bombimbi much more susceptible to Bayonetta's ladder combos. And right now, like... Look at this, Connor immediately going after Bomb Bimby because he knows with just the size and weight of uh, DK, he's going to have a lot harder time getting out of those ladder combos and it's going to be a lot easier for Connor to kill up top. Well, even then, I, I just think of 
Speaking uh, of killing up top, is that gonna do it? That will! Yikes, already taking a stop. Kata taking uh, Cholog up top and killing him. This is what Bayonetta excels at. Bayonetta excels at fast-paced combos such as this that can kill from minimal percentages. I'm surprised uh, Counter didn't up beat back there. He, he literally had... Uh, oh, didn't do the ding dong properly and did not connect. In, in his sight. Oh, okay, I think he was going for Nine Wind. Even though I, I, I counted Connor, it, there was only like five or six. Connor going again with that up air. The up air will not actually send him to death. Yeah, this battlefield pick is still working out pretty well for uh, Team uh, Team Bimby. Ooh, the up air, not gonna take it just yet. But he's getting closer and closer and uh... Not able to punish Ness's landing and into the... Wow! Wow, that was actually really smart. Using the uh, oh. tangibility of up B when it first comes out. And that's back combo here. back into the, the, the head hit. That back come out from Ness and Trollog is not able to take it. Uh, take it uh, and stock. he decides to trade those stocks. But, again, now he has a lot of aura. Oh, that, that gets that's Bayo, that. but no, Bayo yeah, is triple jump. Bayo, yeah. <laughs> Bayo is a triple jump. He won't, she wouldn't die. Oh, but that will. I thought she got sent down farther than I expected. All right, so it's, uh, it was smart on, too. It was smart, I will say, it was very smart on Connor to actually keep his jump in that situation. He was already off stage and kept his jump to the point where he could recover properly. Yeah. If he hadn't kept the jump, there was no way Bayo was coming back from that. Because just a just a wish switch by itself is such a bad recovery. Like it, it has good uh, good hitboxes. It just well, goes nowhere. Well, if you and want can't if you want the biggest recovery possible, now the up air because DK is so heavy will not kill up top. If you want the best recovery with Bayonetta, you got to do the witch twist. Yeah, then you got to jump into a jump. So you retain your yeah. jump. Ooh, still grabs ledge. Uh, for saying like sometimes at that distance, DK just won't grab ledge. It's frustrating. Like, I, I think he was facing ledge, but uh, sometimes if you're not facing ledge, uh, you won't grab ledge. Wait, if Trollog and... Oh, the baseball nice. bat. I was going to say, if Trollog and Mountain Man can find something here, this is a good punish on the ground, the question. The witch time coming out. Are we going to see anything? No, no punish, really. Because, like, unlike other throw combos, uh, DK has no throw armor. So it doesn't matter in singles, but in doubles when you can hit uh, your, your Oh, that up smash will take grabs. it. That up smash will take it, and Donkey Kong, Bomb Bimby is down Ooh, to one nice stop. 50, but I think that's a little bit too late. Bomb Bimby oh, able to get out those banner the combos. Nah, BMO responding in just enough time to uh, save oh, his the, teammate. That was a witch time into, uh, um, into a bat within, it looked like, for a second. Oh, if you set up into that, I was like, yep. oh my god. All right, BMO. And BMO. Flex on my boy. BMO and Connor take that. 3-0. And now. <laughs>